Hello and welcome back to Deep Rock, everybody. Today we've got a new challenge to take on, which I've been meaning to do for quite a while, but I keep forgetting about it. So we're gonna try the semi-auto Loki only, so we can't use the lock-on whatsoever with our Loki smart rifle, which you can kind of see might cause some issues, at least when it comes to perk, because my perks are kind of weird. It also comes to some of an issue with overclocks. Basically, Eraser is the only upgrade to the Loki when you take this. There's almost no downgrades besides I guess executioner now for uh, everything else we've got here honestly half this stuff doesn't even matter in tier one I'm taking ammo because I wanted to have more ammo but damage would work here too tier two really doesn't matter because all of these are lock-on based so pick whichever one you want I just picked zoom lens then in tier three I also don't think any of these will work maybe super blow through rounds will work with semi-auto fire if so then this is the best option because these other two just simply won't work otherwise tier four we have no options here that help us it's either more locks or faster locks either way doesn't really matter and then tier five also doesn't matter because this is max locks this is max locks and this is uh, putting so many locks on an enemy will zap it so we have at least three tiers that do nothing maybe four tiers that do nothing so basically it's just our tier one and maybe blow through rounds if it works uh for a second here i'm taking the shard diffractor with automated beam controller because i thought this would pair kind of well with it not in terms of like being a good weapon but being kind of thematic where i have to fire and just hold down the trigger then i'm running thorns born ready resupplier dashing beastmaster again kind of my standard active perks taking plasma bursters and everything else is set up pretty normal running two turrets running the same that i usually run on armor and running the same that I usually do on Bosco. So, uh, let's find us a mission. Ah, oh, here we go. We'll do a Dreadnought mission. <laughs> let's see how that works. No shields, no problem. Okay, there's a Dreadnought right over here. Heck yeah. Bosco, can you help me mine this? We have Slayer Stout as well for our beer, so fast pickaxe attacks. That will probably help quite a bit. Oh no, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, look out for the leech, Bosco. He's right behind you. That thing almost took my beard off. At least I got 48 shots. It's almost like having the um, the GK2, but if I can only fire it one shot at a time, I don't know what the rate of fire is on this either. It doesn't feel too bad. Yeah, let's get the Dreadnought going. Maybe wanted to kill the Breeder first, but eh. <laughs> yeah, it's almost like the Hipster for the M1000, but doesn't do as much damage. Um, I do have a lot of shots with it, though, so that's kind of nice. Sorry, little loot bugs, I need your stuff. Just... Alright. <laughs> Tap firing for these is actually going to make this a little bit easier than it usually is, because Loki's not real good for uh, hitting these spots. Ow, he bit me! Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, because he hit some of the presents. I was like, where did they come from? Alright. Oh. <laughs> I didn't realize that other one was so close to me. Let's go pick me up, buddy. We must strike him down while we can. Oh, wait, he's already. Oh, that sucks. I barely did any damage to him. Alright. Back to semi auto Loki. <laughs> and some plasma bursters out there, too. Nearly out of bullets. <laughs> okay, you do. I still got. Two mags left. Okay. Alright. This is not a great spot to be in when this happened, but... Ah, uh, crap. <laughs> okay, let me get out of here. Alright, there we go. Alright, one magazine left. Oh no, just got automated beam controller here for our damage, I guess, which is good enough. Don't 
Okay, I had to stand in the right spot. Alright, um, I'm gonna go back this way. This is a really bad way to go, isn't it? <laughs> um, Alright, flares are recharging, huh? Turrets haven't came back to me either. Bad. Okay, good job, Bosco. Thank you. You're saving me, buddy. Molly! I require your assistance. I also require more Nitra. Molly! Why do you have to be like this? Alright. Yes! Okay, now we just loop back around again. <laughs> okay. Okay, come over here, please. Fine, I'll just pickaxe you to death then. Yes! Haha, -ha, I didn't die to a pine cone. Alright, I need this now. Uh oh, there's a meteor coming in though. Yep, there's a detonator there. He came from the meteor. Or at least it looks like he did. Huh. It's actually doing okay damage per second towards him. Not the greatest, but not the worst. Yeah, I should be able to kill it here and then we can grab the other resupply. Thanks, Bosco. That wasn't bad at all for killing the detonator. <laughs> and I think the roller. <laughs> yeah, we got the roller too. Yeah, let's see how well this works against the Praetorian. Okay. <laughs> it's not the best though. Yeah, because I used up a lot of ammo. There's another one of these? Alright, I've got Bosco with rockets. Let's just take care of that right now. Oh yeah, I can get a Steve. Hit him again. Oh, well, did I actually hit the mushroom with that? Dang it, I might have. Okay, not great for backpedaling either. <laughs> Ah, uh, leech! <laughs> Bosco, assist me! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> There's a roller down here spinning at me too. Uh, leech isn't even dead, that's an issue. Roller's not dead either, that's also another issue. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm leaving that. Let me put these up. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Well. There's a roller take it out. I don't know how quickly this will work either. Uh, I think with the turrets and with Bosco's help it wasn't so bad. Yeah, Alright, I'll just make myself a bridge over here to this nitro. <laughs> That'll work. Then we can fight the Dreadnought. I still have one more down, which I was kind of hoping I'd have more downs, but... <laughs> oh well. What can you do? Alright, which Dreadnought is regular Dread? Heck yeah! I don't really know where I want to fight this Dreadnought either. Get him, Plasma Burster. Get him, Bosco. And then I'll use the semi auto rifle to get. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> I dodged that, but it hit the ground right next to me, so. Didn't even matter. then. I don't think I did a whole lot with the semi-auto Loki. This is kind of the other reason why I didn't want to bring the breach cutters because I could potentially just shoot right through these guys. 
and then it would mostly just be the breach cutter carrying me, which I mean, breach cutter is really good, but <laughs> I would like to try and use this as much as possible. Uh, <laughs> eight bullets. All right, no more bullets. Oh no, I'm stuck in a hole. Stuck in a hole. Okay. I have. <laughs> I have no more ammo again. I guess I'll mine this. I, it's not like it really matters, but. <laughs> oh, hey, that actually hit him. Hey, awesome. Take that. <laughs> Hooray. All right, now let's get out of here quickly before anything else happens. I'm not taking the time to pick up gunk seeds, and I don't want like another detonator to show up and just blow me up. All right, well, that was the Loki semi-auto only challenge. Loki's not very good if you use it like this. I really got carried by the fact that I had Slayer Stout. Bosco was doing a good amount of the work, and then the automatic beam controller was also doing pretty well. It was okay overall. It feels very similar to like the. Uh, the GK2, but with less rate of fire. It's like in between the GK2 and the M1000 Hipster rate of fire. Somewhere around there where it's like it doesn't feel super clunky, but it also doesn't feel super great either. And uh, yeah, this was like the one overclock we could run with it.